what's going on everyone it's your favorite collector sweet wheels and yes i am back inside a box lunch first i'm gonna start off by showing y'all the shrek collection collectors i want to know do y'all think they should come out with another shrek yes or no and if so what do you think the plot of the story should be sweet wheels want to know i must say that this is a very unique um piece of clothing i must say and believe it or not sweet wheels will actually wear something like this but i'm gonna see if it's gonna go to the clearance section first then i you know i might have a second or third opinion on getting it but for right now even with box lunch money i don't want to get it but the onions all over it that's really really nice i, I like this a lot comment down below and tell me if you got it because i know some of y'all got it because it wasn't fully stocked up in there, which means some folks purchased that joke, and I don't blame you. I really like all of the items that had to, along with this hockey jersey. And this is a nice jacket right here. The earrings that I'm about to show you all, I've shown you all these before. And look at those waffles. I love me some waffles and bacon with some maple syrup. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I need to stop it before I mess around. I ain't got no pancake mix, so I ain't going to be doing none of that anyway. I don't know nothing about that kid I'm showing y'all. I see they okay, they got the license plate cover. Not the gumdrop buttons. And I love my favorite part when old boy had, what he had, two fingers up? Pick three, my lord, three. Or did he say two with three fingers up? Y'all y'all know what I'm talking about. Here we have the Spider-Man collection. I mean, the section. <laughs> yeah, with a collection, okay? At one point in time, I tried to get into getting sweaters, but I've only been able to get maybe three or four that I really like. But I like wearing them, especially if I have like a skirt and some tights. That's a quick go-to look for me. And we got the Spider-Man earrings and we got the Marvel ones up there along with this scrunchie. I have a few of these, but I like to get them on the cheap cheap. Ooh, there goes sweet will cheap cheap. Always looking out for deal cheap cheap. Ooh, there's a sale on Cheap Cheap. You better get it for it be gone, Cheap Cheap. You all, I done forgot about my no-hit wonder. Oh, yes, indeedy. I'm still working on that pin bag down there, that one with the Spider-Man. Yeah, that's a pin bag. This is a cool Spider-Man. And I, you know what? That pin bag is the only Spider-Man, Miles Morales, to be exact, bag. But I don't have, like, the Pony, Pony Parker. What's that name? No. <laughs> the Parker bag. Or the other names of the other Spider-Man. That's all their names. Tony Parker. Yeah. Y'all look. <laughs> Peter Parker. Oh, my goodness. I know y'all be quick to try to crucify me in the comment section when I be getting this stuff wrong. But I, I appreciate y'all correcting me and, you know, getting me together. Because your girl be needing help sometimes. So, this is another sweater. I can tell you, some of these sweaters don't stick around long. I, let me see. I would say the villains one depends on the villain. They don't stick around long. Coraline sometimes don't stick around long. That's why I try to get her as soon as possible in most situations. I would try to snatch her up real quick. Not too much from Coraline lately besides the Series 3 blind bags. And I completed that joke in two days. I don't play no games. I don't know too much about this, but I can tell you the merch that comes from right here be off the chain yes i got the earrings they are so nice and elegant i don't have the bag but i actually like this bag better they have the other one without the leaf and the what is that sprite is that the name oh, that black fuzzy thing on that leaf right there y'all know it for those of y'all who follow this and here we have the zipper pull i might just get this bag next time i go to box lunch now this box lunch here is inside of deerbrook mall in houston this that big old store that's the store it take you at least three or four trips to try to do a video in because all that raising the arm up i told y'all this is a one woman show over here so arms be tired i be having to put my bag behind the counter if i don't keep it on my back because uh, that's just too much weight going on now we didn't move over to the stitch section and unfortunately for me i haven't seen any stitch merchandise that i really like lounge fly oh lounge fly come on in here and have a seat right here now i'm only gonna speak for myself but lately i don't know what's going on at the stitch lounge fly factory but i ain't been seeing a lot of stitch bags i'm really into and uh i mean i'm not so much complaining about it because Yo, what, have, what what they got going on this week? They got that Harvey's Wally release that they got going on over there at shopharvest.com. I'm going to be talking about that towards the end of the video, but I'm going to put this in the video too. So yeah, they got some things that I do want to get. So maybe I need to slow my roll on this stitch stuff. You know what I'm saying? Let me go ahead and jump off there and get into this video. <laughs> Girl, shut your mouth. 
But this is a really beautiful bag. I love seeing shrimp on the bag. And we got the turtles this time. What? No ducks? Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Turtle here, turtle there, turtle everywhere, especially on the side of both sides of the bag. Okay, Lance, I see you switching it up. What happened with the duck? Or maybe it's just me. I'm just so used to seeing the ducks. It's like Stitch and the ducks, they go perfectly together. I mean, I guess you can add a turtle and a giraffe and a horse and a, you know, a fish every now and then, I guess. Now, I'm big on cardigans. Oh, yes, I'm big on that. Matter of fact, I got um, I got one I'm looking forward to getting from Hot Cash. While I'm putting up this brand new bag with Stitch on it, I'm going to be talking about Hot Cash and Box Lunch Money because we're ready to spend. Hey, first, let's talk about Hot Topic. So Hot Topic is keeping that $15 off $30. And I believe it starts on May 24th for loyalty members and everybody else on the 25th. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comment section. And that'll be this month in April. Box lunch money, honestly, I can't think about it in the back of my head. Uh, what is it, May 1st? I think. Y'all correct me if I'm wrong, but before that even happened, I'm definitely going to give y'all the dates. But the whole purpose of me talking about this is to let y'all know Box Lunch is no longer doing $15 off $30. They're going to be doing $20 off of $40 now. Okay? Yeah, I don't know why they switched it up. And yes, they are giving the tickets back away. Yeah, they tried that old test run. And I ain't mad at them. Hey, remember when they had stopped them tickets for the last two high cash, I think, Box Lunch money? Well, it was the last one or two. They stopped giving them tickets yet. Yeah, they back to giving them tickets back out. Comment down below and tell me why you all think they decided to bring it back. I mean, we all kind of know, but I still like to get everybody's opinion anyway because I'm nosy. I know some of you all might be thinking they probably had a decrease in sales. What I'm saying, some of y'all, you know, that's what I think allegedly. And that's a smart move to bring it back if that's going to help the sales and moving product in store. I mean, that's just my opinion. But like I said, I want to get y'all thoughts on it too. Now we got Stitch as the bunny. Listen, listen. <laughs> this is cute. I mean, no duckies, but we got the baby chicks in the house. Now, I love some Stitch cosplay, but this one just don't do it for me. I think the ears, I'm trying to look at my other stitches. Those ones look kind of too small. It looks unrealistic on the front. I do like the bunny ears, though. I do like the bunny ears, but the front, I wish it would have been more lively. Maybe gave it a 3D look with the chicks. And maybe we had something to have his arm 3D lookish. I probably would have went for this one. But yeah, this going to have to be a no for Sweet Wheels. Now the back of that Joker? Oh yeah, I can get with that. I can get with the back. I like the little fuzzy bunny tail in the back. Look at that. That's just so cute. Yes, she is. Look at the poor little baby. Yes, she is. This is the cutest little thing you ever did see. More like a flat fuzzy to me. But we have this Cars cooler bag. Yeah, you can put some cold drinks and some food in there if you want to. I'm going to get it because I'm a big Cars fan. Just in case you all may don't know, may don't know. Oh, my goodness. I need to get my words together. I mean, maybe I need to start writing this stuff down, no, because I ain't going to be original. Because everything I do when I do these videos, they be off the top of the dome. You understand me. Now, I'm going to say it right here. For everybody, we're going to need another scene. We're going to need another frame, another window pane, or uh, something other than this for Beauty and the Beast. It's so much in Beauty and the Beast. We're going to have to get, look look here. We ain't, I want to see this no more. All right? Y'all done made this scene multiple times. You done turned into pins. You didn't got back. Like, no, we're not doing this. Come on. We're going to have to have. I got an idea for your long fly, and I want my 35% plus tax. You know, you slide it up under the table. You know how you drop money on You could drop it on the floor. I just put my foot on it. Y'all know how y'all do when y'all find money in the store. You look around and put your foot on it, and you just slide it to the left. <laughs> That's what I want. I'm just playing. I'm going to need to file it on my taxes. But how about y'all take that doggy? You know, that doggy when it's in this um spell form. That's what y'all need to make as a bag. I'm th I'm going with a crossbody, crossbody bag. Okay, stitch shop though, stitch shopping. I don't like y'all prices right now, but you know y'all could take that price down the back to a hundred, then we we could talk about something or make it a mini or something. But y'all can do something other than this idea right here. I mean, I like this part right here. They look like they're really in love because they are. Oh, they're so cute together. I just love them, but I don't want to see that stained glass no more. Here we have this bell bag. Now, when I saw this bag, 
I was thinking this bag could have been in books of a million. That's just my opinion because she got the book. Is she singing to these sheep? I can't remember that movie as much. One thing I can say about a lot of these Disney princess movies, I be wishing I had the same connection that they have with the animals in real life. You understand me? I wish I can sing the sheep and, you know, sing the squirrels and have them as my buddy. Like, I wish I, I don't know if I would want some mice cleaning up, you know. I'd probably get a couple of dogs or something. Or, yeah, ain't gonna be no mice in here cleaning up because I probably accidentally forget that they helping me and just stomp them out. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but I be wishing I had that connection. Probably, and with some birds too, because I don't know, for some reason, I got this tree where I live at, and I'm joking with this love boo booing. And I just well, I got my car washed. And I see that I ain't going to get into what I just saw today, but whatever. But yeah, I kind of like that they have that connection in the movies. Look at my boy right there. He just enjoying himself. And look at the bunny like, yeah, I'm next. How cool is that to have all these beautiful creatures around you and just mesmerized by your voice? I probably wouldn't keep not one animal around. It'd be like them videos y'all be seeing with people singing and them dogs they looking all crazy eyes all wide <laughs> that's how it'd be if i started singing matter of fact i got other folks like oh my goodness nobody don't like hearing me so i'm not i'm gonna you know i'm gonna push it don't you think i had to correct myself before i check myself i want to know if this is serious because this is the third bag in my opinion they seem to fit the other two bags the maleficent and the aerial one and if this if that's the case, I hope they do a Cinderella because it's been a while since I've seen the Cinderella bag I love. Now, I got my eyes on that Stitch Shop one that's $125, but I'm waiting on one of them sale sales on LoungeFly.com so I can get that joke at least half off. I'm okay with half off and more, but other than that right now, I just keep my eyes on it to make sure that joke don't go in low stock. So like that cars bag I showed you all, this the Mickey Mouse cooler bag. And I probably, uh, I actually like the Mickey one better, but I'm going to get cars because that's my movie. We have this Minnie Mouse crossbody bag. Comment down below and let me know if this bag is a yay or nay for you. Now that I'm looking at Minnie, a quick fun fact. When, it come, when I tell certain individuals I'm into Disney, the first person they say, oh, so Minnie Mouse is your favorite? And I can understand because the main characters are Mickey and Minnie. And I have to tell them, I'm like, no, it's not Minnie. It's actually Cinderella. And majority of, majority of them be shocked. They're like, Cinderella? Why Cinderella? So I'm like, excuse me? <laughs> and yes, that's probably the last time I speak to them. Because we will not be disrespecting the girl. Oh, no, we did not. We did not. See, I can't even get my words together because we talk crazy about her, baby. I start talking like I normally talk and without, you know, the right words. But, yeah. <laughs> Let's get into this bag. Now, in this video here, this is the best bag. This is my favorite bag in the video. I love it. I'm probably not going to get it. But that front pocket is my favorite part. It looks like um, well, open up a letter, you know. I got an invitation to go to Hogwarts next week. Something like that. I love it. Because if you all think I'm going to the land with the Queen of Hearts, and y'all saw them cards running around there with, well, oh, no, 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 ma'am, no, sir. I'm not dealing with that off with your head, coloring the roses red when she know I like Lily's girl style. And I mean right now, because when she did that, it could have been off with her head. <laughs> but you know that wouldn't work in that world so let's just stay away here we have the back i'm late i'm late all right you're invited to an unbirthday party mm -hmm. no if i like the way that sound that sound like we're gonna have a party now because your birthday you ain't gonna make it all you know what i'm just gonna have to pass on the invitations i'm gonna call this the pink section so on the left we got the strawberry shortcake sweater now the strawberry shortcake loungefly.com exclusive cosplay bag will be available on the website, which is April the 12th at 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. That will be on loungefly.com. I just want to let everybody know, I am noticing that a lot of exclusive bags are just regular bags that sell on loungefly.com and they go out of stock. For some reason, they have been randomly back in stock sale that's going on so it's more than likely exclusive bags or maybe some other bags but mainly we focus on exclusive bags that have sold out but they have a few more left over and they're putting them back on the website on loungefly.com i'm going to try my best to keep up to date with stuff like that so i can let you all know 
basically what i'm saying is say for instance that strawberry shortcake bag sells out and you missed it if you can avoid paying over retail for it i would suggest you all wait because you just never know it might come back and on um, come back in one of those back in stock sales that they have going on i'm pretty sure that's how a lot of you all were able to get bags that you missed out on i mean i'm at the point right now i'd be waiting on the sale like no other just so i can get something now we have the spongebob collection i'm gonna be showing y'all two bags start off with this one right here i don't blame old girl look how wide her my listen if i got this dude right here driving me I had the same look with a helmet on. She's a smart lady. She's a smart fish. Yes, she is. She know better. That fool there will drive you off into the deep waters. I miss watching SpongeBob, but my favorite episode is when Plankton was on there. I watched the other ones, but when Plankton, because I just like the fact that he always wanted to try to find out what the secret was. And old boy just was just, you know, yeah. This is a nice coin purse they added attached to it. I mean, that, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I wanted to get it, but I had to hold off on it because I had other things. Y'all, I gotta get my list together. What I got on my list? I got that Cinderella carriage from Stitch Shop. SpongeBob, I don't have any Sponge. No, I got the um, Cosplay Sandy bag. That's the only one I have. This one here is nice too, but I, I think I'm a slightly pad. I, i'm just gonna do that here we have the back of the bag which is boating school okay that's why he was driving that mrs puff boating okay yes if that's on in the if that's in the tv series sweet wills missed that i didn't catch that episode this kitty meal i almost ordered it online i almost did and i'm so happy i didn't because when i got to the store and i'm seeing it like you all seeing it in person but i was actually there there i was like thank goodness i did not order it it's a nice bag but it's just not for sweet wheels it's it's not for me and this is one of those ones you like who i'm glad i left it right where it's at this might fit somebody else's collection but not for me all right everyone so that'll do it for my video today i hope you all enjoyed don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel and until next time sweet wheelers and other collectors out there take care